Hello and welcome back to the Salon Teach video channel. In this video we're going to look at commissions. Specifically we're going to look at simple regular commissions. Now commissions are very important incentives and they are used to reward employees for the sales they make. Salon Teach allows you to reward employees in multiple ways. One, by each item they sell, and this is known as simple regular commissions, float commission rates, or commission based on PPA, per person averages. The float commissions and commission based on PPA are a little bit complicated and the manual has details on how to set them up. In this video, we'll look at regular simple commissions only. Setting up regular commissions on products or 10 services is very straightforward. Uh, for each and every employee that is to receive these commissions, we need to take the following steps. Let's go ahead and open up an employee profile. I go to the employees button on the top, I go to manager, I get a list of the employees, and let's say I want to set up commissions for Nathan here. I open Nathan's profile, and on the fifth tab here on the top, which says commission, I click on it. And right here in the first box is where I check mark all the things that I want to happen. So if I want um, Nathan to receive commissions on products that he sells, I click yes. Commissions on 10 services that he sells, I click yes. And commissions on surcharges, the upgrade uh, charges, then I click yes. Once I have done that, I click save. The section here at the bottom is for float commissions and for PPA commissions, which we are not going to talk about in this video. Now, the three things that I performed here, the three check marks, we have to do that for each and every employee that is to receive commissions. Now I will go and mark the products and set it up that are eligible for commissions. So again, I go to setup and I go to the product I could have gone to these uh, 10 services and I'm going to pick up this product and on the second tab the dollar tab right here is where I would put in all the parameters that I want for the commissions let's go one by one and see what let's look at the commission flat dollar amount this is where if I want to give him a flat dollar amount every time he sells that particular product I would put in that amount. If I wanted to give him a couple of dollars, let's say two dollars, when he sells that bottle of lotion, I would put in two here. Let's put uh, two here, just for example's sake, and I would save. Commission as a percentage of the price. If I wanted to pay commission as a percentage of the price, let's say 10% or 15%, this is where I would do that. Let me put 10% for this uh, sake of argument. Or, if I wanted to give him a commission as a percentage of the margin, I could do that here. Uh, putting a commission as a percentage of margin might have some advantage in the sense that it will prevent you from paying commission on services or products that have been discounted below the cost and thus costing you money uh, to sell that service or that product. Most generally, percentage of the price or a flat rate would work. I would save it. Now that we have set things up, Salon Touch going forward will calculate the regular commissions earned for each employee based on the commission settings that we just chose. This amount will be listed on the regular commissions report and the various employee reports can be run to see what the commissions are for each and every employee. Since Nathan is clocked in, let's go ahead and uh, make a sale under his name. So we'll pick up the product here and uh, we'll tender it, cash. Now we can go to uh, the reports and check out the commission reports just to make sure that Nathan did get his commission. So I go to the third tab, the employee tab and it was regular commission, so I click on it and I would uh, say, okay, show me all the totals for all the employees for today. And it there we go. It pops up and says Nathan earned $6 because he got 10% uh, of, the, of the selling price plus $2 
per bottle and he sold two, two, two bottles. So there was $6 total. And that's all there is to sim setting up simple commissions. I hope this was useful and uh, check out the manual for more details on other types of commission schemes. Thank you and have a great day and we'll see you again soon. Bye.